Hey guys, Ryan here for Bender Wins. Hope everyone's doing well today. Here with your daily free picks. All right, guys. So yesterday uh, we went one and three. Um, lost in our Cleveland game. Had a nice lead early on, but as you know in basketball, an early lead uh, doesn't really mean very much. Um, Auburn, Mississippi. Again, another game. Beat the closing total quite handily. Um, first half looked fantastic. As a matter of fact, at one point it said we had a better than 85% chance of winning the game. Um, and then they just ultimately stopped scoring. So a little bit disappointed in that game. Um, Raptors again, you know, lost there despite, you know, reverse line move, nice money distribution, system indicators, etc., etc. Um, our only bright spot, uh, Samford, um, and we managed to get that win. Uh, but again, you know, um, not, not the day we were looking for masterclass. Um, we managed to go two and one. Um, we hit our two unit play. It should have been a three and one day. Uh, we had uh, Lamar and nickel state over 145 landed right on 145. Um, they missed a ton of shots at the very end, including uh, a free throw with 13 seconds left. And then, uh, a short little jumper with eight seconds left. So should have been a three and one day, but look, um, we're right, we're right back where we were a few days ago when, you know, I can, I continue to say, I told you guys straight up, you know, there's no difference between the free picks and the masterclass, but with masterclass, you're going to eliminate variance. Okay. You're going to, I give just as many two unit plays to free picks as I do to masterclass. Okay. Um, so at the end of the day, uh, I'm just tired. I'm, I'm tired to be honest. I'm tired in general. Okay. I'm tired of listening to the whining. I'm tired of every day, you know, when there's a losing day, hearing people like bitch and moan about God knows what, you know, I'm giving you guys 55% winners. If you don't like it, go the hell somewhere else. Seriously, I'm, I, I, this is the one YouTube channel where I will tell you, don't watch my channel. Go away. I don't want you here. Okay. So it's come down to this guys. Look, I'm, I'm frustrated with this. Okay, I, I honestly, I don't need this frustration in my life. I really don't because I do this to help you guys. And look, this is such a small percentage of the people that, you know, most of you guys don't need to hear this because most of you guys always have that positive mentality. Um, those of you that don't have a positive mentality, um, I, will, I will direct this towards you 100%. Because, so first off, I'm gonna make this abundantly clear. Anything that even resembles something negative I'm just banning you from the channel. I'm not responding anymore to negativity. I'm just banning you from the channel. So you can watch the videos. You just can't comment or contribute or do anything like that anymore. So that's first and foremost. Secondly, um, I, I'm telling you guys, like the people with the, the negative attitude and the snide little comments and the underhanded, you know, little things about every little losing day, every time we never see them when we have a winning day. No, they never come out then. When you have a losing day, oh yeah, they come out. And you know what? I can tell you guys, I've been doing this a long, long time. You don't have what it takes, okay? So I'm telling you that right now to save you money. Stop betting on sports. Take up knitting or sewing or something else to fill your time because you're going to lose money. You are going to lose money. There's no question about it. You, you don't have the mentality that you need to properly manage a bankroll. You don't have um, you know, the psychological capability of dealing with swings and sports betting. If you are getting upset after a one in three day or a couple losing days in a row? What happens after an absolutely abysmal month? Ask yourself that. You'll be done. You have no shot. I'm telling you this straight up, guys. Look, you know who, I mean, you, but these people probably don't know who they are to be honest with you, but you know, the people that come on here and they get absolutely frazzled after a losing day or two losing days, okay? This is, this isn't bad. We're not actually doing that bad. Like, you know, I, I don't get it. Like I really, really don't, but you know, I get tired of negativity um, and I don't need it. I really don't. So look, when I started this, guys, I started this to educate people, um, you know, give people a, a chance at least at beating sports betting because really the general public, we know the numbers. What, what, 1%, 2% of the public beat the sports book? That's it. So I want to give people at least, you know, a fighting chance. And it was my hope that, you know, maybe a small subsection of the people would actually embrace the stuff that I'm saying, and maybe we take that number from one percent, maybe up to twenty percent. I thought that'd be that'd be pretty cool, um, and I think we've done that. I really do. I think we've done that. Um, but 
I don't know. At the end of the day, it's just, it's become frustrating. I take hours, hours out of my day to do this every single day. I don't know how many days I've taken off in the last couple of months, but not many. And I just don't know that it's worth it anymore for me. I really don't. Like, you know, I, I don't do this for the money. I don't do it for, you know, recon recognition in the community. I don't. I really don't care. Um, but what I ultimately keep coming back to, guys, every time I tell myself I don't want to do this anymore, I keep coming back to the 20%, okay? Okay the 20% or maybe it's higher, I don't know, the 20% of people that, you know, have embraced this and the messages I get where, you know, people have completely changed their sports betting and then messages with I get from people who say they bought all these like new things like and, and I think that like that really, honestly, um, it makes it worth it for me. It does. It does. But, you know, I started out giving one free pick on Instagram. I give one free pick every day on Instagram. And then it turned into this YouTube channel. And, um, you know, I, I had, I don't know, I didn't really have a game plan as to where it was going in it. It grew and, and I'm excited that it did. Um, you know, and I thought at a certain point, okay, well, look, I was giving out a pick. Maybe, you know, I can give it a little bit more. And I figured like people could handle it. It's clear that people, for the most part, cannot handle it. But I'm not going to let that affect the people who can handle it, okay? So ultimately, guys, you know, I want to get that off my chest, but the, the bottom line is there, there's going to be some changes. Um, first and foremost, guys, if you're doing what you need to do um, and you're a great part of the community, then nothing really needs to change. But if you're a negative piece of shit that comes on here just to, you know, to rip on me or to rip on other members of the community, you know, that's fine. I'm not even going to respond anymore. And that's probably been my, my worst, uh, the worst aspect is that I do respond. Um, so I'm just going to, I'm just going to block you from the channel and there's not going to be any warnings anymore. That's it. Okay. So again, guys, if you, you know, if you went one in three yesterday, um, I'm sorry. I apologize for that. I hope you've been with the channel long enough that you've hit 55%, doubled your account. You're welcome, by the way, for going 14-0 on the election. We won our last bet yesterday. Um, as ugly as that fucking day was. That, that's one of the saddest days I've ever seen watching that on TV. But anyways, it, that is what it is, too. Um, look, at the end of the day, guys, bitching that Masterclass gets better plays, that's like opening a present on Christmas Day that you got for free and looking over at your brother and sister and crying because theirs was slightly better than yours, okay? So at the end of the day, guys, if you're upset the master class is winning right now, then, you know, spend the money or go somewhere else. I don't care which, really don't. Honestly, guys, master class has been fantastic for me because it gives me a captive audience that's interested in learning and sports betting, and it gives me that opportunity to teach them more advanced theories, okay? And at the end of the day, yeah, you know what? I included my free card, my full card in it, as well and uh it's gone well it's gone well but you know i don't i don't really don't want to hear the negativity anymore so that i think that's enough about that um i'm gonna take a couple days off from doing the free picks and uh i don't know i'll 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 be back when i feel like being back so here's the plays for today guys um first off cincinnati plus five and a half next uh two unit play washington stanford over 137 and finally, Illinois, Northwestern, under 148, one unit. Okay, so Cincinnati, plus five and a half. Washington, Stanford, over 137. Illinois, Northwestern, under 148. Masterclass, guys, I have five additional plays. Sorry, um, the Washington, Stanford was a two unit play. So Washington, Stanford, two unit play. Masterclass, five additional plays, uh, one NBA uh, for college basketball. And that is it. So thank you guys very much. And as always, guys, have a very lucky day.